step back three. It's good. It's unguardable. James has the best feet in the NBA. And so a lot of things that he does, one-on-one um, -on -one isolation moves and stuff like that, other players have tried to mimic it, and they can't do it. James's rhythm, his ability, I think it's just like dancing. It's literally like Chris Brown with a basketball. We take different moves that he already has in his bag or things that he's already done, and then we'll add a step back to that. Step back three on the way. Wow! Butter by James Harden! Y'all know I'm on a show, NBA Countdown, where my man Paul Pierce up, says man? that he invented the step back. Right, right. But James Harden is the master of the step back. Right. Talk to me about that step back that James had. Yeah, so the difference is there's been other guys in the, uh, in the league that try to do it, try to copy it. And what they do is they put two hands on the basketball. When you take two hands on the basketball, then you cut your steps out. So what James does is whatever uh, move he does, he's going to stop. He's going to keep one hand on the basketball, then he can make his steps. He'll stop, he'll, he'll tap, right, and then he makes his, his move, mm -hmm. right? So I have Daniel do it full speed. So he's getting in his bag, he stops, see how that left foot kind of taps. As soon as mm -hmm. he taps, he gets his balance, then he can push off and get that separation. So James has one of the highest usage rates in the league. How do you train that? The amount of responsibility that he has for our offense, you have to be in shape. So we start off every workout, he's in the weight room for about an hour, and then we get on the court, and now you're playing through fatigue, and you're still having to go game speed to get separation and get all these shots up. But now when we come to the, to the regular season, it's a cakewalk. We have a drill, um, I call it the Beard 100, where we still need James Harden to be James Harden in the fourth quarter. So what we'll do is we'll go through a variation. There's three-point shots, a hundred of them, and the goal is to be better every day. Twenty-one action. In this situation, I'll act like the big and the guard in the, in the pistol action. So he'll hit me, I'll hit him back. I'm acting like I'm flaring off the big, and then I'm the big coming back to set it. We do this in our, in our pregame room. Up. So this is the end of the workout. Like I said, I just call this, I call this dancing. This is literally like Chris yeah. Brown, Chris right. Brown with the basketball. If you have to identify one thing that took James from six man of the year mm -hmm. to the MVP of the league, what would it be? I remember one time he asked me, do you think I can be a top five player in my position? The thing that separated James from these other great players was he could also pass the ball. To me, with the Thunder, he was their best player in the pick and roll, so I knew that if he got more minutes, more touches, um, and got his own situation, you know, I just felt like his career would really take off. Harden to the lane, count it, and one. I noticed with James a lot of times, like when he gets in here, if there's a defender coming, yep. like his his second step is in right. the defender. So a lot of guys are trying to shy away from the contact. Mm -hmm. James, James is looking for it. Do y'all drill that as y'all going through stuff like, Make sure you hit his body. What we do is I'll stay here on his hip and I'm swiping down at it. So he has to stay through the contact because most guys aren't strong enough to take that contact mm -hmm. and still finish the play. So I'm going to stay on his body, one dribble, go ahead, boom, I'm going to there, and then he's going to have to finish through my contact. Is James impossible to defend? Chris Paul said it a couple weeks ago or a couple months ago, so I feel okay backing him up since he said it first, but James is, to me, the best offensive player ever. You look at guys throughout our history, they're maybe arguably better scorers, but guys that be able to score the ball and assist the way he does, I don't think we've ever seen it to this level. And he puts